Good afternoon. People are fed up with the dog abuse going on in one New Mexico city. In the past year, they've seen one high profile case after another, and they claim no one's doing anything about it, and it's giving their town a bad name. News 13's Mo Hyder is live in Las Vegas with what they are now doing about it. Mo. Kim, people in Las Vegas have launched an online petition demanding police and animal control address these dog abuse cases. That petition already has over 2,000 signatures. For the last couple of years, the city of Las Vegas has been home to some horrific cases of dog abuse. Last week, this dog, now named Hubble, was found nearly starving to death. There are now arrest warrants out for his owners. Earlier this year, Cubby made the news after he was found walking the streets of Las Vegas on two stumps. He's been shot. Last year, it was Fonzie, starved to death while chained up. Well, that's uh, pretty pretty sad to, to see an animal on, a, on, on poor condition like that, no? And uh, I believe that if you're going to have a pet or something, take care of it the right way, you know? It is a bad issue. I own two dogs myself. Um, I am very adamant about mis not mistreating animals. Now some concerned citizens in Las Vegas are lashing out at Las Vegas police and animal control with this petition on change.org saying, in the last decade or more, not one single animal crime has been prosecuted. And your inability to do your job gives outsiders an impression that Las Vegas is a hellish place. You know, and it's sad it has to come to this point where, you know, me saying addressed on a regular basis, because uh, I know their hands are full, but. In just less than 24 hours, the petition has more than 2,000 signatures. The police department agrees and needs to step up its enforcement of animal cruelty laws. From this point on, is like I said, everybody is receiving a, a directive from the city manager, and we are to um, just be more cognizant of when you walk into different areas. So, And Animal Control says it's doing their best it can while it deals with five other cases of dog neglect. We are trying to educate the people and okay. trying to help them out so that way we can actually end up changing it with time. Now, as you just saw, many people are not happy that their town and their home is associated with dog abuse cases. Chief Montano said now that it's brought to your attention. They can get rid of the stigma. Kim, back to you. Okay, thanks, Mo. No word on when police will arrest Hubble's owners or why they haven't already. They will be charged with a felony for Hubble and for misdemeanors for the four other neglected dogs found on their property.